friends. Today we're going to do a drawing that has to do with this picture of Venice, Italy. In Venice, Italy, they don't have streets that cars drive on like they do in Denver. They have canals which boats float on to get where they need to go. They also have a lot of jellyfish floating right now in those canals that they can see. So that's what our drawing's about today. All right, here it is. This is what we're gonna draw today. Today, we are going to need a pencil, something dark. You can use a black pencil or a black crayon or a Sharpie, which is what Miss Julie's using. Let's start our drawing. Oh, I also forgot. We also need glue, colored pencils, our paint, our leftover construction paper, and scissors. Okay, let's get started. The first thing that we're gonna do is we are going to take a line, our pencil, and we're gonna draw a line straight across their paper. I already did that. Then I'm going to take my dark color and I'm gonna go right over that line, just like that. And it's okay if I have a little pencil showing, I could just super deep duper erase those. Okay, then this is the part I'm gonna show you guys that you'll have to do on your own. Then I'm going to add a square, a rectangle, and I'm going to use another square, except I'm going to do a castle pattern on the top. And that's what you need to do. And I'm going to put that over here. All right. Then the next steps I did, guys, I added windows and a house and a, a triangle for the roof, windows in here, and a fancy door, which is really an upside down fat U shape, and handles. And then I outlined it. And the last thing I did on my drawing is I added three rectangles underneath. And those are the reflections that we can see of the buildings because this area is gonna be our canal. Okay, friends, I just finished coloring my tape, my buildings, okay? So now let's get to the fun part. Now we're gonna take our pencil, oops. Now we're gonna take our pencil, we're gonna make a half circle shape, or fat U, on our extra construction paper and, cu and cut it out doo -doo -doo, really quick. And that's the body of our, je our jellyfish. Then we're gonna take our other leftover construction paper and just cut lines out of it. Skinny lines, just like this. And those are gonna be our legs. And what we're gonna do is whoop, we're gonna open our glue. We're gonna put a little line across. We're gonna add our jellyfish legs, our tentacles, our jellyfish tentacles. We're gonna add those in there. And then it's gonna look like this. And then you need to wait a minute to let it dry. I did that. So now I'm gonna put these on my paper. I'm gonna put just a drop, 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 not a lot. And I'm gonna have them floating because remember, this is gonna be our canal. add as many as you want. I'm just going to add three right now. 
And those are our jellyfish. We put just a little on there. Now this is the fun part. Now we're going to paint. So let's get our paintbrush. Oh, I'm going to use this paintbrush because it's fatter. Dip it in just a little bit. And then I'm going to do my blue for the water. And I'm going to very lightly kind of go over everything. And that's a little blue. So I'm going to dip mine in and maybe just lighten it up. Because remember, when we use our paints with our watercolors, we're using it. And it's okay. You can go over. Just hold on to your jellyfish and paint right over them. And right over our reflections. That's important too. And I'm just going to come down here. Remember to get my brush nice and wet. And I don't want to make it too wet. Because we want to keep it nice on here. Nice and fast. All right, guys. Go right over because we want them to look right underwater. Okay. Whoops. Get it all done. Okay. All right, guys. And now, I'm just going to go over and keep them nice and smooth. A little bit more blue on there. Curve on the edges. Do, 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 do. All right. There we go. That's my water. But am I done yet? So I'm going to rinse my brush so we don't mix our colors, and I'm going to add a little yellow down here. Mm -hmm. And over here, and then I'm going to wet my brush again, and then I'm going to rinse it out nice and good. I'm going to add a little orange up in here for a beautiful sunset. And maybe just a little rinse up there. Just to help it out. And you see, Miss Julie's using her watercolors and the water to mix all those colors together. But I don't want to mix them too much. Just enough to color all of our white spots on our drawing. Oh, and I got to go down next to the buildings. And there we go, guys. There is our jellyfish swimming in the Venice Canal. I hope you liked it. See you next time. Bye, friends.